Hello, I'm going to do the Capricorn energy reading, and this may or may not resonate with you. If it does, take what does. If it does not, leave what does not. All right, so I pulled out just the major arcana, and we're going to get a message for you. We're going to look at past, current, and future energies. All right, so in the past, we have the death card, could be Scorpio. Current energies, we have Justice and Libra, and... The present energies, we have price, High Priestess, and I felt like one more, The Fool. All right, so in the past, we have the Death card, and let's get some clarifiers for that. All right, Nine of Cups, King of Swords, and The Fool. That's interesting. Let's see, can you see? There you go. Okay, I have to move this over. There you go. Trying to get my new setup done <laughs> my camera, sorry. Justice. We have Page of Swords. The Devil and the Ace of Wands. And then the Future. Knight of Swords. High Priestess again, and then Eight of Wands. All right, so in the past, we have the Death card. So that you were trying to move on from something, that you were trying to change things, that I feel like things were successful for you. I feel like you started something new. I feel like you started something that you were enjoying because we have the Nine of Cups. We have the King of Swords that's looking right at the Nine of Cups here. So I feel like you were enjoying your time in the past. I feel like you were doing something that made you happy. You started something new, um, that you started something exciting, that you were having that fulfillment, you were feeling good. And I feel like, I feel like now you're looking back at it and you're questioning it and you're saying, was that really the right thing for me? In the moment, I feel like you felt that it was the right thing for you, but I feel like as time has passed, you're wondering, you know what? I'm wondering if that was really the right thing for me, whether it's a job or it's you moved to a certain place or it's a relationship, whatever that thing is. And I feel like you're questioning it. And because we have this Page of Swords and we have the Devil energy, but then we have the Ace of Wands, so I almost feel like you're ready to start something new and to move on from this situation. That at the time it worked, but now you're thinking, I don't think that's the right thing for me. Future energies, I feel, again, like I said, that you want to start something new. You have the Knight of Swords, which is looking back over all of this energy. And look, and you're looking back and you're saying, you know, at the time I made the choice that was the best choice that I could make at the time. But now I'm realizing that it wasn't the best choice for me or that I need to change things, that I need to do th things differently, that I need to move in a different direction. Because with the two High Priestess there, I feel like you're really listening to that inner voice and you're having these strong feelings in your having all of these signs that are saying it's time to move this way, right? It's time to move on. It's time to look towards the future because we have the eight of wands, which is going that way. And I feel like you're, you're kind of looking back over everything. You're saying, yep, I did the best that I could, but now I'm listening to myself and now I'm ready to move on. I don't feel that this was a bad situation. Um, I feel like it could become toxic if you stay in it, but I feel that you're having those feelings that you want something new. And I just feel like your inner voice is really going to be coming out for you. And it's really going to be saying, hey, it's time for change. It's time to move away from this, that that has expired. And now we're ready to start something new. All right. Thank you so much for watching. As always, stay positive, stay safe, and I will see you next time.